No fun facts today. No, uh, we are in a hurry <laughs> today, right? Ready? Yeah, sure. Hello and uh, welcome to Global Investment Real Estate and Residency Show, Phase 2. An exclusive event brought to you by TEG Media. We specialize in organizing live and online events. I am a director and co-founder and a part of this exceptional team. My name is Abdul Basit and I'm your host today. I would like to start it by thanking people of Africa for such an overwhelming and warm response. We are totally rejoiced and excited to be here today. Uh, during the preparation, we have received many questions such as, uh, is it legal or is it a scam? Can I have my children with me? Uh, can I have my parents uh, with me? Can my family work there? Can my, uh, 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 my wife, uh, come with me, how much time it will take to be a citizen, how, what are the residency requirements, uh, and many more, and many more. I uh, assure you that all of your questions will be answered today during the presentation. Use this opportunity, use the question and answers section uh, of Zoom and live chat on YouTube and continue asking about your queries and we are here to respond. Uh, with that, I would like to introduce our speaker for the evening, uh, who is presenting Feria DC. Uh, his name is Mr. Eduardo. Mr. Eduardo uh, has a 15 years plus experience uh, in engineering and uh, consultancy, and he is here to present Feria DC and uh, tell us more about the EB5 and USA project. Hi, everybody. Uh, welcome, uh, Mr. Eduardo. How are we doing today? Hi, Abdul. Hi, everybody. Thank you for having me today. Uh, we're actually doing great. It's a great semi-sunny day in northern Spain where I live now. And it's great. Actually, great to be here. I love to, I love to be, visit these countries we are in. We have been, uh, I've been in, in most of these countries where, where today we're in today. And lovely to have some people from, from these I must tell you, Tanzania. people of Kenya, Tanzania, Uganda, and Ethiopia, uh, they are amazing people. We have received such a nice response from all of them, uh, queries, and they are very responsive. We have received so many questions, even on our WhatsApp, we are still receiving questions. So they are uh, waiting for you to answer all of those questions. So yeah, shall we sure. start with that? And, and it, it, especially if, if there's something that comes up like later today or tomorrow, just don't hesitate to ask uh, through WhatsApp or through email. I will share our contact information and I will, be, I will be getting in touch with you after the presentation so you can ask anything you want. You can go over the presentation again in any detail, or operations or, 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 or about the investment or about the EB-5 program. I'm not a lawyer, but uh, I, can, I can guide you through what's going on or what can happen. Uh, but definitely the best thing would be to get in touch with one, one of our lawyers and set a meeting with them. But I, I'm ready when you, when you are, Abdul. So when we I'm are set, ready. We are ready. Let's start the show. Okay. Okay. The, 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 we're, <clears throat> we're discussing today about uh, Feria DC and, and uh, uh, the possibility of, of, of um, basically the possibility of dreaming big. This is, your, this is your moment to really dream big. Okay. Uh, and by, by big, we mean the B5 program. It's it's a, a an employment based, hence the name EB five um, program. That it is the world's most desirable U.S. immigration investment program. Uh, it is administered by USCIS, uh, which is the citizenship citizenship, uh, uh, citizenship and immigration services of the United States. Okay, uh, so it's basically for those who are. For, for those, those who are asking, it's not a scam. It's a, it's a government-run program. We are basically uh, applying for that same kind of benefit. Uh, OK, what is this all about? Uh, the the EB-5, uh, it's an, an employment-based uh, program created in, in 1990 to, to stimulate the, the, the uh, 
job creation, okay? And allowing foreigners to become permanent residents and then be uh, candidates for citizenship, okay? Uh, it is the best method to obtain a green, a green card by investing money in the United States. It's also the fastest method to uh, get citizenship uh, and green card, of course. Uh, and, enable, and, and it enables foreigners to obtain permanent residence. Okay, it, it's basically the, 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 the summarizing everything the US citizenship, it's only an investment away. Okay, uh, what, are, what are the benefits? I mean, it has several benefits. I'm gonna just go over uh, six of them, which, which we think it's, are the most important. One is unrestricted employment options. You can go to the United States and work in whatever you'd want or not work at all if you, if you don't want to work. You can, sit, you can keep your, your, your job in, in, in Africa if you, if you, or your companies in Africa if you, if you want. You can bring your companies to the United States if you want. If you want. Uh, there's also a greater chance for, of, uh, for college admissions for your kids or, or for if you are a young, young person going to university, there's a younger, uh, sorry, a greater chance to for college admission once you have the green card. Uh, tuition are tuitions are cheaper, which is also great. Once you have all, already done this investment, so tuition should be cheaper. Uh, you have the opportunity to travel freely within the United States and af abroad. I mean, you are you can you can live in the United States and then travel freely to any country you want or any country you have permission to um, go back home uh, to Africa. Uh, anytime you want and you can always go through the residence uh, lane which is faster and nicer than the than the foreign lane uh, there's also you are eligible for support through retirement uh, and the one of the coolest things that the, the benefits are for your entire household this means that it applies for all your family uh, your kids under 21 years of age and uh, any any of them that are not married, okay. Um, so, what are the requirements for this? First, the investor needs to uh, invest nine hundred thousand uh, if the investment is within a target employment area, TEA area, uh, which our FEDIA project is within a uh, target employment area. If the, the, the if the project is not in the, in, a, in a TEA area. Well, the investment is $1.8 million, which is double the amount. So it, it, it's, it's steeper and it's more difficult to make. Uh, each investor must create 10 full-time jobs. And that's, I mean, if you, if you invest 900,000, those 900,000 must create 10 full-time jobs. Uh, and you have to demonstrate that the, that the, that the funds you are, you are investing are not, do, do, doesn't uh, come from, from any criminal activities and, and, and that's it. Basically those, those are the three biggest requirements. I mean, of course you will have to be, uh, you have to go through a background check and the source of funding must be, must be, must be demonstrated. And, and I mean, but it's basically is, that is what it needs. Just those three things. Okay, if you are interested in, in, in going through the project investing in the project and going through the process of the AB5 process to get the US green card, just let us know and we'll set up a, a meeting with our attorney and then they can help you with all the details. If you decide to go with to another attorney, we can also help you out. So that's not a problem. Okay. So we want to really summarize this. Uh, this is your fastest way to get the US green card and by, by, um, um, and, and getting the way for the U.S. citizenship, okay? Uh, remember, you can get the permit, permanent residency within 18 months, which is super fast, super quick. Um, and it's really, really, really good. It's a really, really good program. So how, how, do, we, how do we make this, okay? Um, what we're offering is an investment in, in, in our project, Feria, okay? Feria is basically a fixed income property investment that provides uh, food service, food services, retail space, operations, systems, infrastructure, and uh, to multiple subtenants in in something we call a culinary hall, a culinary hall. Okay, this is this is basically a property business. It's a real estate that will also uh, uh, serve as a launchpad for chefs and food service. Okay, 
uh, it is also um, they will get it, they will have the chance to interact with the general public in a, in, a, in a European market environment. So it will be super super nice and super fun to to go into. Okay. Also, each uh, each chef will be will be provided with a fully equipped kitchen, so that is ready to use. So they are basically uh, investing. Uh, or, or making use of, of this kitchen with minimal risk and, and minimal investment, okay, which is great for for after after the the, the pandemic. We we count on on a lot of chefs uh, chefs uh, having having gone out of work, and so so that we will bring them the opportunity to rent space here and and give it a go to their new businesses. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> Feria is basically uh, located in, in DC's downtown area. Okay. Um, it will have, as I said, fully equipped, fully, eight fully equipped kitchens. Uh, it will also, uh, it's, it's also a unique concept in an emerging field. Uh, the, the concept is part of the search in a sharing economy businesses such as Airbnb and Uber, which most of, of you would, would probably know. Uh, currently hosts like Feria have become the fastest growing retail niche in the food industry uh, for several years, according to several industry magazines. So we see a really good opportunity for, for, for this project. And basically we, we really want to be different as other EV5 projects. And, and I'm gonna summarize this very, very quickly too. Why is this Feria, Feria project different? We have very fast time to market. So we have six, six week construction uh, uh, period which means that we hope to be open by the end of the year, by the end of the same year. So you will see, you will see, you will see your investment um, uh, providing, um, providing, or, or actually giving return to your, getting return from for, from your investment very very soon. The returns are very very good. I will I will discuss that further uh, further along our, our, our presentation. There's a solid performance because we have a great team and. Basically, one of the greatest things is that at least nine hundred percent, sorry, ninety percent of the space will be occupied from the start. Okay, so we already have chefs signed in, and we are counting to have some uh, new new chefs and, and shops coming in very very soon. So that's that's great for this project. I, I really want to go to uh, what, what an exceptional operating team we have. Uh, there's me, a senior professional with twenty plus years experience in operation management and project. Uh, and project management. Uh, I was uh, operations director for a window covering, one of the biggest window covering corporations in Europe, which is based in Spain. Uh, and I have several master's degrees in several businesses. Um, my, my one of my partners is Juan Ignacio Salas. He's a chef and entrepreneur. He ha he has he studied in Le Cordon Bleu in Paris and in Le Colo Atelier de, de lo, of Lausanne. He has he has developed several concepts. Uh, in Venezuela, he, ha he, he has been operating concept in Venezuela for the last 20 years. He also um, developed a, a concept in Miami, which he successfully sold last year uh, to, dedicate full, uh, fully, uh, to dedicate himself fully to Feria. And we also have Michael Sternberg, which is our, our start partner. And, and really, when it comes to starting successful restaurants, Michael has been there and done that. Uh, we know him for, for his role founding and managing uh, many of uh, uh, DC's, Washington DC's iconic restaurant, uh, which I could name, but I mean, there will be, there will be, we will get too, too, too uh, distracted with that. Okay, Michael also went to serve as restaurant division president for a center plate, which is one, a 1.2 billion contract uh, food service company. He's a president of uh, his own, uh, Hospitality and, and and restaurant consultancy service, uh, and and it's also an emeritus member of the board of like director of the National Restaurant Association. So he's very respected in the industry. He also is serves in the in the DC's convention center board. So he's basically uh, you know a guru in the industry. Also, we are associated with uh, the Janu Afrique Group. Uh, Janu is. Uh, Christopher Janu, which is his, their, their, his, their manager and, and founding and managing partner, has been developing uh, projects in Africa for a long time now. He develops especially 
in Zambia. He has been developing in Kenya. He lives in South Africa for, for most of his time, but he has a great operation in Africa and he's, he's also investing in this project. But he's our partner in the, in the African chapter of the project. Okay, then um, we want to stop here and, and, and discuss our alliance partners and stakeholders. This is our first EV5 project. And although we are very good at operations and very good at restaurant operations, we really want to give our investor the, the assurance that their money is not just well invested, but uh, being, take care, being taken care of. Okay, so but because of that, we got the, the best team in EB5 development. Okay, the, the gold standard, which is uh, the immigration lawyer that we are using for all our immigration uh, documents and, and, and the business plan and, and everything. It's all Ewan Arsenal and Lair, which is one of the best. They, they process thousands of, of immigration visas every year. We also have NES Financial, which we, which will be taking care of the EB5 fund administration. And they will have also a platform where you can see your what, what's going on with your money and how it's been invested uh, in, in an app and, in, and over the internet. They will give you a periodical, uh, periodical um, information on what's going on with it. Also, we have two regional centers as, um, supporting our project. One is uh, Causa from Puerto Rico and the other one is EB5 Affiliate Network, which is, which is one of the biggest networks of, of regional centers in the, in the country. Um, CAUSA and EB5 will be, uh, an EB5 affiliate network will be overseeing the fund disbursement too. So we will have a, a great team securing what's going on with the investment. Okay, so let's, let's, let's go on, on how this project makes money. It's, it's, there are two key things here. One of, one of the important things of the project, it's of course, get you the green card. That's our main goal but also uh, getting your, your, your money back. So how, how do we make that money to pay you back? Uh, first of all, it's licensing. I already said that this is a property, a, a, a real, real estate business. Uh, um, we basically re rent kitchens and store spaces uh, and we uh, lease and have, a, a, the main figure comes from lease and share a share of the sales, a percentage share of the sales. So if, if if their restaurant is successful, of course, there will be, there, we will have more success and we, we will work to, towards that objective. Uh, we also are, are being, uh, are gonna be taking care of the bar operations, which is a very, uh, a very important source of funding in, the, in any United States food related business. We also are, are doing incubator offspring, offsprings. Um, so um, by, the, by this, we mean that if, if any restaurant wants to grow beyond Feria, and, and, and have a brick and mortar, their own brick and mortar restaurant, we can help them out and then we can be partners in their, in their, next, in their next iteration. Okay, uh, we are also gonna have uh, events and catering. Uh, we're gonna have a specially dedicated kitchen to do parties and events and, and, and wine tastings and food tastings and, and uh, let's say um, cooking shows, um, cooking classes, that kitchen is gonna be fully operating all the time. So that's gonna be an important source of revenue too. We also have a plan. We cannot, we cannot uh, add the numbers for this yet, but we're also planning to have sponsored and, and advertisements uh, of, of perks and services related to F&B and not necessarily that. For, for, for example, imagine that Toyota is launching a new car, a, a brand new car. And they want to make uh, an uh, They want to uh, put the car inside our premises, so so our public can 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 see the car. So we're we're gonna we're planning to do that. We're also planning on doing mentoring. That's that's one of the reasons we have this uh, extra kitchen uh, for for mentoring and, and talent de talent development. And there's there's also one thing. Um, now nowadays, with after the pandemic, we have. Uh, noticed that there's a lot of um, delivery going on. I mean, the delivery industry has always been strong, but now with the pandemic has getting has been getting like tenfold strong. So we are planning to take care of all the delivery operations. And as we're gonna have eight different kitchens, uh, imagine that 
you as a client can uh, order food from eight different kitchens and it will be delivered at your doorstep uh, at, at once. Uh, so you can, for example, order food for the whole family. They can all, they can all order different things and they will, they will arrive at the same time at your house. So you will enjoy it at the same time with your family or friends. Okay, so uh, how does this work? Okay, uh, we already know how, how we make the money. What is it we need? What is it we are looking for? Okay, the capital we need to develop this project is 8.4 million, which are distributed as, following, as, as follows. We are looking for 6.3 million uh, uh, US dollars from EB-5 tickets. That would be seven EB-5 investor slots. Remember that uh, I said before that we are, our investor tickets are, are, are $900,000 each. Uh, so we need just seven. These are, our, uh, we are giving a 5% interest rate, which is very, very rare for, a, for a, an EB-5 project. Usually EB-5 projects give around one, one and a half, maybe 2% of, of interest rate, but we really want to sh uh, share as much, as much uh, uh, fun and money with, with our investors. And we really want to be the cutest bride. So we are looking forward to people to come up as, as this, this would be not just a, a, a really good way to get a visa, but also a nice investment. Sorry. We are also uh, are getting um, 1.7 million of friends and family and our own funds. We already have this, this money committed. Um, some money has come in. We already have spent more than a million dollars here. So it, we, are, we are basically on the way. There's also a, a $400,000 commercial investment coming, coming from, from, from a commercial entity. Um, and the funds will be used uh, this way. We will use 5.6 5 million uh, in project building, construction, equipment. Remember we are, we are giving away, we are leasing uh, fully equipped kitchens and, and basement and a basement with uh, fully, fully equipped basements for, for storage and everything. So we have to, we have to get our equipment. And 2.8 million fund, uh, dollars uh, for startup funds and working capital. We're also getting, which is um, very, very nice, $1.67 million of landlord commitment. After we finalize this construction, we're gonna get back $1.67 million from our landlord, which is, gonna, which is gonna be used to start saving to pay you back, okay? This investment is for, a, is for an expected job creation of 174 jobs. Of course, this is an approximate and, and, and this, this is where, uh, what our economic impact study that it needs to be presented to US, uh, USCIS uh, says, that we are gonna be creating at least 174 jobs. So if you remember, each, each of these tickets are gonna be, uh, need to be generating 10 uh, jobs. So we're gonna be uh, creating more than 200% the required jobs. So if, if by any chance, we fail to create 170 jobs and we create, let's say, 125, we still are going to be able to provide your visa to you, which is basically our main goal. Okay, this is, this is, our, our, this is a summary of our prospective p and I don't, really don't want to get in, in too deeply into this so our attendants don't get bored. Uh, you know, numbers are, are destructive and people get bored. We can share, of course, I'm gonna be sharing this so you can study this uh, together. I mean, with me or, or, or by yourself, whenever you want. As you can see, Ferry has a very good return. And this is uh, perfectly, and it, and it is a project that's perfectly capable of delivering what we promised. On the first year, we're getting $1.6 million from the landlord cash back, as I already said. And we, and, and that's, that's, that's what makes the first year's operations um, uh, come into the into the green so remember that we will hope to have this operation running by the end of the year so we're counting on october november to 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 have this open uh and and this this is basically the real figure okay okay this is now comes the exciting part this is a real building where we're we're going to come in the building you, you can see that this this in front of you is the space where Freddy is going to come in 
Uh, so this is this is for real. This is something to be really excited, uh, really excited of. I mean, I, I am excited, super excited to have this already uh, least and secure. And I want to go over the, the project status and milestones. Okay, construction should start uh, uh, April 2021. It will depend on, on the permits, construction permits, and and you know bureaucracy. So we are counting on on starting on April. Uh, so. Uh, uh, <clears throat> So we can stay in, on schedule. The liquor license has already been granted to the project, so that's that's a plus. We 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 already have permission to operate the bar. Uh, as 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 I said before, this is a very fast time to market project. A construction construction and setup is expected to be six months. Uh, our architecture our architectural team says it's going to be twenty weeks, so we can six months to be really uh, on top of it. And. We already leased the uh, secure the lease on, a, on this trophy location that you already saw. Okay, it's it's across from the historic Carnegie Library, which I'm I'm going to very I'm I'm going to show you further further in the in the next slides. Uh, the, the Carnegie Library was converted into the biggest Apple store in the country. Okay, and it's a huge building with a huge amount of traffic. It's also very very close to the convention center, which you will see in the map in the map uh, further further. Um, uh, along our, our presentation. The contenants in the building, which is, we think this is very important because these are people that can, that are gonna be needing services and we want to be their primary, uh, the, we want to offer them, the restaurants are gonna, are gonna be our tenants to be their, their primary food source for their businesses and, and the business meetings. Apple's gonna move, Apple's moving their govern, government relationship department to this building, Becker Bots, Two, two floors. They have their huge uh, uh, law firm, and they're getting they're moving their headquarters to the to this building. Equinox Gym have oh, uh, the the floor that's on top of us, so we already have people doing wor uh, workouts, so they can come and have food afterwards to our premises. The Information Technology Council, Industry Council, it's already it's already moving, and we work at least three whole floors for, for from the building, so it's it's already ready to be occupied and, it, and it's looking forward to get food, food going, moving into the, into the building. Okay, what's, what's going on with the, with the, with, with the neighborhood? Uh, 30, 34 year median age, which is younger than the US average in, in big cities. The population has been growing steadily since, since 2010, uh, more than 100,000 daytime employees. Uh, Average, high, uh, average household income, it, it's quite nice. Uh, we have set more, well, almost 7,000 hotel rooms uh, and, and more hotels are being constructed. So this number will, will go up. So, and every hotel room, it's a prospective kind for us. So we have plenty, plenty of uh, clients here. Well, there's also uh, 217 annual convention centers, uh, uh, convention center events which is the, the convention center is across the street. You're gonna see pictures of that. And it's, it, they're fully booked all, all year long. Also, there's the Capital One Arena, uh, that's three blocks away. And the Capital, block, the Capital One Arena has 220 events a year. That mean, that is um, hockey games, basketball games, um, concerts, and, and basically that, that's people that needs to go out and have uh, food after after the event and uh, before the event. So food and drinks are guaranteed. Okay, this uh, this is a, a, a map. Of, of, so you can see you can locate where ferry or you can see where ferry is located across across the Carnegie Carnegie Library. A little bit uh, uh, less than a block away to convention center across the street from the from the roundabout that the Carnegie Library is. City Center DC, which is a very high class uh, Fost Norman Foster's. Uh, project that has all the all the top shopping in the city, uh, for example, Louis Vuitton or Hermé or uh, Chanel, Gucci. All all of them are are uh, in, at city center, which is less than a block away. Um, you can see the Grand Hyatt. Um, the mall is just four blocks away, and and we are really between the the White House and the U.S. Capitol. You can see it. You can see it here, like with a little more perspective. This this rendering is 
made from the top of the of the convention center. You can see it down below where the Apple sign is. That's the Carnegie kind of Library. Where in front in front of the of that of that library, there's there's our space there. You can see the Capitol on on the back. So you you know where we are. Union Station, the main train station of the city, is already it's it's a few blocks away, and and you know we have we have the best location in the city. Okay, I want to go over our, our operational strengths. Uh, this is this is very important for us as, as you, we want you to feel that your investment, not just to feel, but to know that you, your investment is secure and, and that everything will, will, will be according to plan. We have a successful and experienced Gordon Blue chef and hospitality professional. That's one, our, one of our partners. One of DC's most, most experienced restaurateur and consultant, consultant in the food and beverage business, just Michael Sternberg, our other, other partner. The best ordering, ordering management and restaurant technology available that we have been developing on, on our own and with several uh, big companies to, to have a, a specific Feria product. We have the best location in DC with continuous traffic all year, all, all year long. I mean, nobody can deny that the location is perfect for this. So we have the Brand Guild, one of the best, best PR, PR firms in the country basically uh, to basically help us Get lines of people or, or help people. You know, we want really, we really want people making lights outside Feria, uh, and and we really need to make the most out of the out of the of the um, um, social social networking to to be able to do that. So and th these people is the best at that. Uh, we also are having minimal operational involvement in each, in each restaurant. So we don't operate restaurants. We are landlords. Uh, remember, this is a real estate business, and that's that's what we are planning to do. And we're also experts in operation management and the restaurant business. So we basically have a very very strong operation going on, and we also want to make in, uh, our investors part of our project. Um, we are just three three partners here. Um, so if by any chance you invest in our project and you want to, for example need to uh, or need to see what's going on or need to know what's going on just you, should, you just can give us a call to any of the three of us and we will have to get in touch with you uh or or if you're in the city you can just come and with with us and we can, you can go to Ferry have lunch with us and i mean this is this is your project too okay uh we really want to make you feel secure about your investment and your ab5 process this is our contact information uh i hope you you uh, uh, contact us with any any prospective doubt you have or any inquiry. Um, we will be getting in touch with you in, in any case. And guys, that's that's has been all. I mean, I could I could be talking about Feria all day long, but uh, Abdul has been has been pushing me for several events, so so I can keep it short because we we get really excited on it. Thank you so much, Eduardo. Uh, you definitely can uh, talk about it and uh, I can see the love behind this project. And this is very assuring that you are not just uh, doing it on the investments of uh, different people, but also putting your investments into the project as well. This is very reassuring uh, to all of us. Just to clear one thing out of this, uh, can you please mention uh, the exact amount again, uh, that how much every investor is supposed to invest minimum? Sure, I mean the the what the, the, let's 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 get one thing clear first. The investment amount is not set by us; it's set by the U.S. government or by the basically by USCIS, by Congress and 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 all the people that develop the program. Uh, the original amount is one point eight million. If you go to a project that's not located in a TEA. Uh, in a target employment area. Because Feria is located in a target employment area, we, are, uh, uh, we, we have the possibility to offer a 900,000 US dollar investment to each person or to each household, just to give it to each investor. So that, that will be half the usual amount. Okay, if you want to go, if you probably go to a project in Florida or a project in, the, in, in New York, in the middle of the city, you will probably get uh, bigger projects 
that, that have longer time to market, uh, that need $200 million and, and will probably be raising capital for a couple of years. And they will probably ask you for $1.8 million in, in your investment. Great, great. We do have a few questions here with us. Sure, go ahead. Uh, sure. uh, the first question we have is that, uh, is it possible to apply uh, for the green card online or do I have to hire an attorney for that? Um, I mean, I think you can do it on your own, but I would definitely recommend the, the, the use of an attorney so they can, very, they can do all the sorts of funding uh, process According to the law, that, that, that's that's going to be that's that in in the in the end that's going to be cheaper and faster if you wanna if you wanna if you wanna do it than than if you wanna do it on your own. I'm, I I think you can do it on your own, uh, but again, I I recommend you go with with whoever you choose. I mean, you don't have to choose a lawyer. Uh, you can you can choose a lawyer you know or a lawyer somebody recommends, and then contact us and and we can we can work with them uh, through all through all the all the process and, and, and that, that will be okay. But I really recommend the lawyer. That, it, it will be much, much quicker. Great, great. Uh, I've just received a message from one of the viewers uh, on our WhatsApp uh, saying that, uh, can it be a shared investment as well? Sorry? Can it be a shared investment as well? Like um, it's two, two persons uh, having a collective investment into this project as one? Uh, it would it would be basically it would be okay if they're part of a family. I mean, and and by this I mean if it's your spouse or your or your husband, it can be it can be it can be. I mean, if you if you, if you, if, it, if that person is your wife, your husband, it can be it can be done in conjunction. But it, it cannot be done with a friend, for example. It it have to be one one person or one family investment. Uh, and the, uh, it uh, applies to the same for the brothers as well? Yes, yes. I mean, yes, if, if you are, for example, if you are brothers and you're under 21, then you could, your father can do investment and, and you both would be, would be beneficiaries of the investment. You have to be under 21 and unmarried. But if, the, if uh, the, there are two brothers who are above 21, can they no. be partners in that? No, no, that it has to be what we one person per per household. Perfect, perfect. Uh, is there a waiting list uh, for them? Uh, not now. I mean, to be honest, the the there's a lot of of of, of people in line to do the investment. Because uh, because of the pandemic, all the whole, the processes and the, the offices have been closing and opening, and you know people has been sick and people uh, there's there's less people to to do the whole the whole thing, uh, government wise. Um, but there's um, there's also um, a limit on how many people can apply per country uh, per year. We are at the beginning of the year, so that's basically reset now. Uh, that restriction is going to be lifted from from I think it's the end of this year or, or beginning of next year. Uh, so I recommend I recommend that you do your investment as soon as possible because that will be, that will assure you the 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 quickest access to the green card. Great. Uh, one more question we have is that how do I submit my investments and uh, when will I get my initial investment back? Okay, you will have to, I mean, the, the investment works this way. You, you, you get in touch with us, we finalize the paper, you, 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 you put the investment in, in, our, in, our, in our escrow account or, or an account or the account of the, of, the, of the new commercial entity, which is governed again by the regional center, uh, by any NES financial. <clears throat> and, and you can get, and after that you will get uh, you you will do the application for the preliminary green card. You will get a preliminary green card in less than eighteen months. Uh, I heard but I heard some lawyers uh, in a, in a, in a meeting a couple of weeks ago saying that there was a fourteen month wait now. So it's it's pretty good. Um, and after eighteen months, um, you the the I mean after we have the project running uh, and and the the government can verify that the investment 
is generating those 10 jobs, you can start to get your money back. I mean, that can happen between three and four years. Um, but our, our initial plan is to give you your money back after five years. Um, or that's our, that's our worst, can I, worst, worst case scenario plan. After five years, you get your money back. But if the government says that we can begin paying your money back before that, we will start paying your money back, I don't know, maybe three and a half, four years into the business. So you can, you can get your money back real, really quick. Great, great. Uh, one more question is how much time do I have to spend in USA? You don't have to spend any time in the US. You have to, that, that's a very good question. And most people don't know this. But if you, if you get the green card, you will have to go to the United States at least once every six months. But you can go for like a weekend and then go back home. So that's, you just have to get your passport stamp and then go home. But okay. that, that, that should happen every six months. There's, I think there's some extension you might ask because you can, you can always justify that you are um, getting ready to move and you need more time, whatever. And, and you, can, you can spend more time out of the country. But, but that's it. You just need to stamp the passport every six months on a regular basis. And, that, and that's it. Okay. Uh, and when can an uh, investor apply for citizenship? The, you, can, you can apply for a citizenship after you have five years with a green card. So you get a green card and you, with a green card, the only, I mean, you have, you have very few, um, I mean, there, there are a few things that, that, that are, you are not, you are, you have no right to if, if you have the green card comparing with it, with the citizenship, you cannot vote, but uh, uh, there, there are not many things you are, you are not allowed to, you, you, you are basically a, a national and not national. Uh, just to put it some way, that's a very, very <laughs> bad description. That, that, that's that's uh, completely fine. Uh, with that, I would uh, like to say thank you to you, Eduardo. We have uh, quite a few questions still uh, left, uh, but if we start doing that, we'll need a couple more hours uh, continued. Uh, so uh, we'll finish it here. And uh, I would ask all the people who uh, have sent us questions that uh, please uh, send us more questions. If you have on our WhatsApp, you have been uh, in, got in touch by us. You have our email addresses. Uh, please uh, use our social media accounts to share your questions if you have any. Uh, and uh, we will also get back to you. Our presenter will uh, get in touch with you in the next uh, couple of days. And you can uh, get your answers question directly as well. Uh, let's, let's do something, Abdul. Let me let me let me let me send send share my email address here, uh, if you don't mind. Um, please. Uh, through the through the chat uh, through, through the chat application. Uh, wait, hold for a sec. Uh, and if if any, um, sorry, we. Yeah. So, sorry about sorry uh, about that. Let me let me let me. Yeah, yeah, okay. ah! I cannot believe it. I wrote it that three times. That's completely fine. Uh, we will be sharing uh, these uh, email addresses with our uh, audience anyways. And uh, we'll be sharing uh, the email addresses and phone numbers of our audience that we have received through the registrations and you can get in touch with them as well. So uh, with that, I would uh, stress uh, that this is a very good time to invest in USA. After the turmoil of last year, America is getting back on track. It is uh, getting uh, coming back to, this, to the position it was, uh, always was. And this is actually the right time to invest as soon as possible, uh, get your uh, investments done and be there. Uh, vaccinations have also started. So this is getting back on track. Everything is getting back on track. There's, there's a very important thing, Abdul, to, to what, what, what you're saying is that remember that if, if somebody, we, count, we can count on doing things right when they, when they want to do things right, it's the American people. So they, they can get the country back on track like in, in six months. So, and, and they're gonna do it. I, I, I have no doubt that with, with the change of attitude in the government, we will have, we will have a, a, a politics aside, we will have a, a, a pretty good, um, I'll say, um, uh, response from, from the whole economy, the, 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 COVID, the pandemic and everything. I think it's gonna be great.
at the end of this year, the United States is a place to be. Well, with that, uh, I would again uh, like to finish the call here. And uh, uh, we, will, we would like to say thank you to all uh, the people who joined us. Uh, thank you so much, Eduardo, uh, for the presentation and all the uh, discussions that we did, uh, all the answers that you gave. Uh, all of the audience who are listening to us and watching us, please follow us on our social media accounts. Please uh, subscribe us on our uh, YouTube channel. You can always go back to the recordings of these sessions. And uh, if you have any questions, you can leave there and or ask us directly. Uh, thank you so much, everyone. Uh, we will see you very soon again. With thank that, you. good luck. Take Thank care. Thank you, everyone. Bye.